Hey guys, what's going on today? Bo Joe here, back in NHL 19 to do a uh, Christmas holiday themed pack opening for you guys today. Merry Christmas to you guys. Uh, when I am recording this video, it is Christmas, but by the time this comes out, probably gonna be past Christmas. So, happy belated Christmas to a bunch of you guys. Hopefully, you guys got a bunch of cool swag under that tree. Hopefully, a bunch of it hockey related. I know I got a bunch of cool stuff as well. And for a Christmas gift to you guys, I'm bringing you a video. First one in like two weeks. I know I haven't been posting a lot of stuff here on the channel as of late. Hopefully that'll change in the new year. I'm kind of just taking the back half of uh, these next two weeks, kind of just take it easy, kind of revitalize, get some new ideas going for uh, the new year to start. And we'll be pushing out some more content to start off 2019 off right. But to end off 2018, we do have some packs to open up for you guys today, and I saved a bunch of these packs that I got at the beginning of the month because I thought EA was going to do something crazy on Christmas and maybe like re-release some legends or something along those lines, but they actually didn't end up doing anything. So we're just going to open up these packs. I got three of each, three minis, three premiums, and three extreme Christmas choice packs. Uh, we got over three million coins right now, which is fantastic, and hopefully we get some of those like new... Uh, nations cards that are out right now. I know there's a bunch of cool of those ones out currently. Team of the Week's not bad either, but let's get rolling. So let's start by opening up the mini Christmas packs and uh, I'll share with you guys what I actually ended up getting for Christmas. So, what did I get for Christmas? Uh, well, uh, I got an 85 overall Team of the Week John Klingberg. That is exactly what I got for Christmas. So that is a very, very good start. Nathan Noel. Who remembers him from our Philadelphia Flyers franchise mode all the way back in like NHL 13 franchise mode legend as X Tech would like to say so that's awesome Darude Sandstrom as well Felix Sandstrom that's nice and these packs are really really tiny but I'll take an 85 overall team of the week John Klingberg for sure not bad good synergy on him as well so not bad first pack uh, so I got the typical stuff that a any 26 year old would probably ask for got a lot of nice clothes which are always good got some new jeans sweatpants which are always nice couple more button downs which are always cool couple flyer shirts even though I really didn't ask for much flyer stuff this year because I already have a ton of flyer stuff and really don't need anything else uh, to add to my flyers collection so we got that we got alcohol we are pretty much sitting pretty solid on the alcohol content uh, for uh, me got a couple board games as well to bring to the uh, bring to the party on New Year's Eve so hopefully we'll have a Good time there on New Year's. Make sure you guys stay safe on New Year's as well. Don't do anything stupid that you might not regret doing. Uh, that I'll probably end up regret doing. But don't go drinking and driving. Just don't do that. Just stay inside. Uber home. Do whatever you want. Don't drink and drive. Anyway, let's move on to the premiums. Uh, what else did I get? What else did I get? Honestly, not really much. I got clothes. Got a bunch of gift cards to some places. Uh, I got a Team of the Week, Michael Del Cole. Interesting. Uh, I also got an alumni, Trevor Linden. Cool. Um, yeah, what else? Like, I got a lot of gift cards. Got some, like, restaurant gift cards. Got, like, Wawa, a couple Chipotle's. I uh, got, a, like, $75 worth of Vans gift cards as well. So, I'm going to be picking up some new shoes, which are always going to be nice. Pick up some shoes for the summer, so that'll be pretty nice. Um, anything else, really? No, nothing. Nothing, really. Got a couple candies as well. Always, uh, good to get on the candy game as well. Dude, we are just pulling Team of the Weeks left and right, left and right, Team of the Weeks out the wazoo. Man, so we've gotten Team of the Week Klingberg, we've gotten Team of the Week Michael Del Cole, and now we've gotten Team of the Week Rasmus Ristolainen and Team of the Week Seth Jones, pulling all the Team of the Week defensemen in these packs so far. So Risto and Jones, not the greatest synergies on them, but still 83 and an 85 overall pulls. Not bad, man. Team of the Weeks out the wazoo. Corbin Holzer and Alex Golgoski. We're just pulling every kind of defenseman that you can imagine so far. But yeah, nothing really like electronic wise or video game wise I asked for this year. So I didn't really, need, really didn't need anything crazy like that. You know, didn't really have to ask a lot. I uh, got my parents a lot of good stuff as well. So they were very much appreciative of that. Still got something waiting for my mom for. Um, was supposed to come for Christmas, but then it got delayed. So I was hoping it was going to be for her birthday. And then uh, that got delayed as well. And it's still going to be not even coming like a little bit after her birthday. It's not even going to come to like late January. So I'm a little bit pissed by that. But another Team of the Week defenseman. All right. So we got three extreme Christmas choice packs left. 
let's start diving into these. Let me know what you guys also got down below for your Christmas gifts, especially hockey related. I would love to know what you guys got. Hopefully some sick jerseys that you guys got. Uh, hopefully some swag, hockey tickets, whatever the case. Whatever you guys uh, hopefully got. Okay, there's the other one. There's Wierenski. Jesus. Defenseman, defenseman, defenseman. All right, so who do I take here? I'm probably going to take Wierenski. And probably Jones, right? I'll take the Seth Jones, I guess. I'll take the Seth Jones. I'll take that, and I guess the second round's like Silvers. Yeah, pretty much. So I'll just take Bergfors and Mans Lindback, just because he's there. I missed out on the GOAT there. Joe Gatton B. I know X Tackle. Not be appreciative of that. I'm sorry, Brent. I apologize for not taking the GOAT right there. So we'll take the jerseys and then Snowflake collectibles if I see any. No snowflakes. Uh. I think Christmas trees were Drew Dowdy, right? Yeah, and then what were the Santa hats? I know these ones are for the, um, these ones are for the Forsberg. What were the Santa hats for? Were the Santa hats for the Kucherov? I think they were, so I'll take those. Um, yeah, I'm looking for the Christmas trees and the snowflakes, because those ones are for the Dowdy and the McDavid. I think the Santa hats are for the Kucherov, if I'm not mistaken, so I'm probably going to be selling those collectibles anyway, because there's... I could just buy them out, right? I have enough coins. All right, let's move on to the second one here. Hopefully, we got some good luck in the next pack because we're just pulling every single team of the week as it seems possible in these packs so far. And there it is. We've pulled, I'm pretty sure we've pulled the entire team of the week, the entire defensive team of the week in this pack opening. We've we've pulled every single defensive team of the week in this pack opening. That's pretty crazy. So Jacob Slavin's right there. Vinny Trocek, Ekholm, uh, Jacob Josephson, and Al Iafrady. So... Yeah, we were pulling Team of the Weeks like crazy. Um, so I'm going to take Slavin, and then I guess... Uh, normally I would take Iafrady, I guess, for the, you know, for the sets. But I mean, I'm going to probably just take Jacob Josephson, because it's an ex obscure card. So why not? And then for this last one, uh, Christmas tree, Christmas tree. Cool, we'll grab the two Christmas trees for the Dowdy. And we'll call that there. And we got one more pack to go. Can we get any more Team of the Weeks? Hopefully some more uh, Nations cards. Hopefully we get some Nations cards. But it just seems we're pulling the entire Defensive Team of the Week here in this pack opening. If we can get any forwards for Team of the Week, that'd be really nice to round this one out. Nope, there's another Team of the Week, Zach Dalpy or Dalp. Uh, there's another Ryan Pulock. There's Barkley Coutro. <laughs> the one had to fit. And a branded Carlo Christmas card. <laughs> special cards out the wazoo. I'm sorry, John Gibson. You were just not that special, unfortunately. Yeah, I guess I'll take Noah Hannafin. I guess I'll take Brandon Carlo. Um, yeah, I'll just take Brandon Carlo because, you know, it's a unique card. Why not? We'll take those. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> Team of the Weeks. Team of the Weeks, man. Team of the Weeks. Th this, that's what I'm titling this pack opening, man. Christmas was just full of Team of the Week pulls. That is, like, the an absurd amount of Team of the Week pulls I've ever had in a pack opening, without any doubt, I've ever seen. I've, I'm pretty sure I had at least, like, a Team of the Week card, if not in every pack, like, every other pack. There was a Team of the Week card in almost every pack. That was pretty crazy. What a crazy haul of Team of the Week cards there for, uh, for Christmas. So... I'll give you guys a team update as well as I normally do. Hopefully I'll be bringing you guys some more spotlight videos in the future because that, uh, that spotlight video on uh, this guy right here on Terry Sawchuck is doing pretty good. It's got around like 8,000 views so far, so thank you guys for that. Appreciate that uh, on the views on that video, but um, yeah, the, so far we got Gardner, Sackick, Madonna. I don't think that's changed. Uh, Forsberg, actually it has changed because I got the Sackick now from last time so that changed uh so we got forsberg's new to the team uh the patrick kane is new so we got the thanksgiving patrick kane now uh there's the two cards from the newest competitive season that i got so taves and march so have joined the team the um the uh evo mitch marner is on the team right there uh nico he is still right there we're ready for all defensively we have the drew dowdy and that's pretty much it still uh horton ifrady mckinnis riley and then uh, still saw Chuck in net. Klein is the backup. So not really much has changed with the team. It's pretty much just been Forsberg, Kane, Taze, Marcheseau, and the Drew Dowdy that have been added to the team. Hopefully looking to get somebody to replace Morgan Riley and a good left-handed uh, left defenseman there with passing playmaker to come around and we'll replace him. But we're sitting pretty right now uh, for the uh, for Hut right now. Currently 
progression wise as well we're on tier 24 out of 25 so after we complete this tier we will be one tier away and after we complete that next one we will have that 97 owen nolan to potentially achieve it's gonna take a while to get that but hopefully i will uh, be able to get that i just recently uh moved up to tier 24 today grinded out a couple games uh for comp seasons today to get me the 70 total wins i needed to progress to this so here's what tier 24 looks like for you guys in case you were curious so i need to score 170 goals which shouldn't be a problem i can do that against the computer same thing with 600 hits i can do that 40 sets shouldn't be that hard either since i can maybe do that silver coach trade in set which hopefully will i can do that quickly before it goes away for christmas for the holidays a thousand shots on goal shouldn't be too crazy hard that one's just going to be the hardest and most one to do 80 games 80 wins online in competitive se or in competitive seasons that's just going to be hell of a grind i'm going to have to grind the living hell out of like the hut champs qualifiers to hopefully get some easy wins there but that'll be the pack opening a lot of team of the week cards in there merry christmas to you guys still have a couple more videos coming out before the end of the year i'm probably going to go record a gm mode or franchise mode right now it's probably gonna be a long one so stay tuned for that other than that i'll catch you guys next time peace